Hi everyone, we will make a student management system application using Python. In the second part, we will make the database connection. Finally, we will add text function to the buttons. You can subscribe to YouTube channel for more programming projects. I am transferring the SQLite library to able to connect to the database. I can create database using connect function. I will create a variable for the table name. I will create a variable for student ID. I will use all the variables created while creating the table. I create a few more variables for students. You can change the color names as you wish. I will create a table using the execute function. I will use the variables I created while creating the table column information. When the application runs, if the table does not exist, it will be created automatically. I probably made a mistake in the coding. I need to put a space after the exist statement. Database was created automatically. I am creating a class for the students. I will create variables similar to the columns created for students. I can declare variables in the main function. I am making variable definitions using the sub parameter. Thanks to the cell parameter, I can use the variables in all functions in the class. I will add text function to the two buttons created in the design part. I will add text function to the two buttons created in the design part.
The text functions will be called each time the buttons are pressed. I am creating a function for the save button. I am adding global values. I will also use a global list. Finally, I add the column variables at the global level. I can access the text of the entry objects using the get function. Then I clear the entry object. I do the same for college. I will use the int function for the phone number. Finally, I do the same for the address. I will add the information to the database. I can use the insert function. I have finished the coding with the commit function. I am showing a text indicating that the text entered by the user are saved in the database. I made two mistakes in the insert function. If I don't fix it, it will probably throw an error. I will use the message box function to display the message. I am creating one more text function to display the database information on the screen. I close the first window. I am creating a second window. I set the title of the new window. I will add a label object.
I am setting the font using the config function. When the button is clicked, the first window closes and the second window opens. I will display the information on the screen with the three view function. I set the column names. I am calling the table in the database with the execute function. I am creating a variable. I will be using in a for loop soon. I am inserting the information in three objects sequentially. I then increment the i value. I fix the three object with the peg function. Finally, I make it work continuously with the main loop function. I enter the information. The information has been successfully added. But when I click other buttons, I can't see the information. I probably made a mistake in the coding. I need to look at error message. I made a mistake adding the parentheses. I am re-entering the information. Successfully added. When the other button is pressed, the information is displayed on the screen. We don't have to close the first window. I will not use the destroy function. I am resaving the information. The first window didn't close when the second button was clicked. I didn't see any errors while the application was running. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, you can specify them in the comments. You can subscribe to YouTube channel for more programming projects.